Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. It is Andrew here from iDownloadBlog. And as iOS 10 approaches, we are covering all the biggest changes that you're going to see. So in this video, we're gonna talk about the phone. So first up is VOIP calls or voice over IP, and that's things like WhatsApp. Now in iOS 10, those can actually show up on your lock screen and you can answer them just like a standard phone call. You can see there, that was for WhatsApp. Now aside from VOIP calls being on the lock screen, we also have extensions for the native phone app. So when you have a call come in right on the top of the screen, right below that, you can have a little alert using a extension from another app that can let you know maybe if something is possibly spam. So in this scenario, you can see here from Apple's demonstration at WWDC when that call is being marked as spam. We also have new contact sheets. So I have Johnny Appleseed here. You can see we have a nice image on top that shrinks as we scroll down the page, as well as those quick buttons to message, call, or FaceTime that particular person. So really nice new updates here to the contact cards inside of the phone app or in the standalone app as well. Now, aside from the phone and the contacts, the other big addition is new changes to voicemail, and that is actually transcription services. Obviously, Apple has been doing a lot of transcribing in the form of Siri, but now they're finally bringing that to the native voicemail app. So when somebody calls you, it'll now transcribe that into text. You can give Apple feedback of whether or not that was helpful or not helpful. And in my testing, it's been fairly solid. Now, it's not going to be perfect, but then again, none of them are. I've used Hello Mail for a while, as well as Google Voice, and neither of them were you know, spot on. This did really well, and it only dropped out the name in this particular voicemail message. If there's anything that we forgot to mention about the phone app, or if you just wanna let us know what you thought of the phone app altogether, let us know down in the comments. iOS 10 will be dropping this fall for all eligible devices. Please go ahead and subscribe to keep up to date with all of our iOS 10 news as well as all the other OS updates Apple will be releasing as well. And until next time, this has been Andrew for iDownloadBlog.